kidneys are optional. Suni, we were very concerned about had she had enough time in training? Was she ready? Was she going to be able to get her qualifying score? And then she started the competition on beam and was like, I'm good at this. Super difficult, even though it was watered down, quote unquote. Some days she's so swollen, which is something that happens with kidney disease problems. She can't even put her grips on. And I just was not expecting her gymnastics to, I mean, we've seen it from her in college for two years. Like her gymnastics is not diminished in any way. Her fitness level for being able to do these routines without being tired, which is one of the hardest things when you're injured, is fine. She just looked totally ready. I mean, the routines she did were exquisite. I mean, this is why she's an Olympic champion, Spencer. I keep telling you don't count is an Olympic she? champion what? out. Yeah, I, I don't know. know if you've heard, but so she is won the Olympic all-around title. The wow. reigning Olympic champion. So the details with Suni is it was a big deal. She had to get her two-event qualifying score here, which she did very yep. easily. Now that she has her two-event score from Classic, she can petition to do the all-around at nationals. In terms of making the world selection camp, you do not have to have compete the all-around at championships in order to right. make the selection camp. I want to talk about the moment after Suni, Olympic reigning champion who didn't think that she would be able to compete necessarily here. She finished her beam routine and then ran to Dr. Faustin and gave her a huge hug. And it was such a beautiful moment because Dr. Faustin had been with her from the very beginning. They're like, we don't know what this is. We're going to figure it out. And how doctors told her she would not be able to do gymnastics this year or maybe ever again. But because she's an elite athlete with superhuman kidneys, she Mm -hmm. was able to manage her health in a way that allowed her to be there. It was the usual doctor underestimating the superhuman ability.